Hi friends, welcome to my Windows 10 Explorer channel. Today we are going to talk about how to control Windows File Explorer using a bunch of keyboard shortcuts when your mouse is not working. So let's start. First, open the File Explorer using the keyboard shortcut that is Windows plus E. This is the basic keyboard shortcut we all know about that. After opening File Explorer, you can use left and right arrow keys to select the drives or folders in the File Explorer like this. From here, you can go to Navigation pane by using the Shift plus Tab shortcut. From in the Navigation pane, we can use up and down arrow keys to access the libraries in the Navigation pane. Here, I am going to open this music library by pressing enter on this and when you press enter on the music library just press tab key to access the contents in the music directory in here you can also use up and down arrow keys to access the files and folders in the directory and also we can use home and end keys to access the first file and last file in the directory and here you can create a new folder by using the shortcut key Ctrl plus Shift plus N. And also you can rename any folder using the keyboard shortcut that is F2. Here I am going to rename this new file by pressing F2 key and I am going to change this new file to old file. Press enter to give the rename option. To search for any file or folder in this directory, we can use the search bar. To access the search bar, use Ctrl plus F shortcut. Here I am going to search for the deck of halls. So I am going to press Ctrl plus F shortcut. I am going to type deck the halls. And with the help of search, I can access the deck of halls txt file and deck of halls mp3 file by pressing the enter key. And now just Use the escape key to close the search bar function and go to the navigation pane. And here you can use the tab key to access the contents pane. To see the properties of any file or folder, use Alt plus Enter keyboard shortcut. Here I am going to see the properties of this file by selecting this file and pressing Alt plus Enter. You can see the properties dialog box in here. To close the dialog box just use escape button. To open the context menu for a file or folder first select the file and press shift plus F10 shortcut to open the context menu. Here I am going to select this new title.txt I am going to use shift plus F10 shortcut to open the context menu. File explorer also shows the file preview. To activate it, just select the file and press Alt plus P to see the preview in the preview pane. Here, I am going to select this new title txt and I am going to press Alt plus P to preview the text file in the preview pane. You can also access the location bar by pressing Ctrl plus L. From the location bar, you can access any location, any drive. Here, I am going to go for videos library by typing videos and press enter. This will automatically open my videos library. Finally, by pressing the Alt key, you will see letters appear over the buttons on the ribbon. You can press Alt along with the whatever the letter is displayed here to activate a button. For example, I am going to press H for home key by using the Alt key. In some cases, we all need mouse pointer. We can access the mouse pointer using the number pad. But first, we have to enable it from the settings. Open the settings by using Windows plus I keyboard shortcut. By using the tab key, we have to open Ease of Access settings. In the Ease of Access setting, again use the tab key to access mouse settings in the interaction side. In the right side, you can see there is a setting that is called Control your mouse with a keypad. Press tab key to access the turn on toggle key and use the space bar to turn on the control your mouse with the keypad setting. In the, when you turn on the mouse keys, you can see there are three settings in the below. 
use the tab key to, to select the first setting that is only use mouse keys when number lock is on just press the space bar to uncheck this so we can access our number pad for number entering and we can turn off the number pad to access the mouse now we can access the mouse with the keypad using the numbers in the keypad like 7 8 9 to move the upward and 4 6 to move the left side and right side and 1 2 3 go to the downside and we can also select any setting or any uh, command using the button 5 and we can also speed the mouse pointer by holding the control button number pad by holding control key to speed up the mouse pointer movement and i can also use shift key to slow down the movement while pressing the number pad keys that's it thank you for watching if you like the video please share and subscribe for more windows 10 tips and tricks